Hey, what's up everybody? This is Son of Apollo back to you with another video. This video is entitled Shopping for Raw Meat on the Cheap. But somebody asked me a question, why do I feed my dog raw meat? Well, we started out with kibble. He was eating blue buffalo. He did pretty well for about six months until he started to develop food allergies. He would get really itchy. And he see he's a white dog and he got really red. He would scratch his fur off. He would be irritable. Uh, this led to vet visits and the vets had no options basically they gave him an antibiotic and a steroid which was a temporary fix very expensive visits i was at the vet each week so i did my own research on the internet and i ran across a video by documentary tv uh, he's got about the best dog video on the net on youtube and the video is entitled how a raw food diet fix what meds couldn't I'm going to put a link in the description. But getting to this video, we're going to show you how to shop for raw food diet for your dog on the cheap. Check it out. Here coming up we have a food that's pretty underrated for dogs, it's called tripe. You got goat tripe, you have beef tripe, tripe. And what these do, they carry enzymes and good bacteria and amino, amino acids into your dog. Um, it helps them digest their food. And typically you want it green. The kind that I got here was washed white. They'll still eat it but it doesn't have the enzymes. But if you could find that green tripe, put that on your checklist. Here's a little helpful pop-up on benefits from feeding your dog a raw diet. Uh, there's a checklist where eating the bone and hard material helps whiten their teeth. That's like nature's toothbrush for your dog. Uh, frees their teeth of tartar, dental disease. Uh, their coat, their coat is shiny, smooth, uh, flake-free, itch-free. Uh, if your dog has chronic allergies or infections, they subside or disappear eating a raw food diet. Uh, their breath is odorless, breath and body. My dog's breath is fresh, never has a smell. Uh, they have improved energy, vitality, they live longer. Uh, decreased visits to the vet. So when you think about that, how many times you visit a vet for your dog with, with ailments, eating a raw food diet usually helps them have better health in general so you're not at the vet. Uh, pay attention to these next two items I'm gonna get. Uh, these are chicken necks, and it's actually what it says. They're chicken necks. Very cheap. It's one of the cheapest meats you can find as far as chicken. And they're 49 cents a pound. So when you think about it, if you get 20 pounds, that's only $9.80. And also coming up, another cheap meat. Pork hearts, 29 cents a pound. So if these are 29 cents a pound, if you grab 40 pounds of pork heart, that's $9.60. Another meat on the cheap are leg quarters. These are chicken leg quarters, which are 59 cent per pound. This 10 pound bag is $5.99. Okay, so how do we do? On today, I bought 52 pounds of meat and I only paid $60.76. So when you think about it, if you're buying a bag of kibble, Taste of the Wild, Raw Buffalo, it's usually the same amount. Um, but the health benefits your dog is going to get and the money you save in vet visits will pay you back. It's well worth it and your dog will love you for it.
Now, if you really want to shop really on the cheap for your raw meat, you can get 20 pounds of chicken necks, 40 pounds of pork heart, 20 pounds of chicken leg quarters, all for $26.40. That's 80 pounds of meat. That's on the... Who'd you doing, about? <laughs> So hopefully everyone enjoyed this video and if your dog has dog food allergies and different problems, try raw food diet for a few weeks to see what happens. Within two weeks, you'll see some results. And also, let me know what video you guys want me to do next. Sometimes I'm a little clueless on what people want to see and how they want to see my dog. Alright, until next time, it's been Son of Apollo. Take care.